please subscribe to Super Saddlers Sip. Right then guys, welcome back to another video and today I'm doing a match review on our 3-0 defeat away at Cheltenham Town. Before I get into this video, if you go on to enjoy this video, please leave it a like and subscribe to the channel. Daryl Clark made three changes to the team that lost last weekend to Southend United and started in a 4-4-2 formation. Michael Duff made one change to his side and his side started in a 3-5-2 formation. The Saddlers had the first chance of the game when Rory Holden fed through Elijah Adebayo but his effort was well blocked by Ben Tozer. There were shouts for penalty appeals for Warsaw as Liam Kinsella was chipped in the box but he got booked for diving. Cheltenham Town nearly took the lead as Andy Williams met a Chris Hussey cross but his effort hit the post. As the game approached half time Warsaw nearly took the lead as Jake Scrimshaw hit a brilliant effort which hit on the underside of the bar. After a half where either team could have took the lead both sides went into half time drawing 0-0. After only 5 minutes of the second half Cheltenham took the lead. Ben tells his long throw and came off Dan Scar which went into an empty net as Liam Roberts came to collect. It went from bad to worse for the Saddlers as we conceded 8 minutes later as Cheltenham Town doubled their lead. Following Andy Williams' shot blocked, it fell nicely to Matty Blair who hit his effort into the roof of the net. James Clark, Wes McDonald and Keelan Lavery were introduced into the game to try and get Warsaw back in the game. The host made it 3-0 in the 89th minute. Ben tells a flick home from a free kick to give Cheltenham Town all three points and to hand Warsaw their fourth consecutive loss in a row. Another frustrating and disappointing performance and result for the Saddlers. I thought we were decent in the first half but when we conceded that first goal in the second half our heads just dropped. There was no fighting spirit and no desire to get back into the game. As Neil Warnock would say, You've got a f***ing night to get three points! I think if we'd have took our chances this would be a different story and we wouldn't be speaking about a loss as the game could have gone either way. I just don't know where the goals are going to come from this season as we don't have a striker that looks like scoring. Even from midfield we don't look like we can create any chances or get any goals from midfield. Daryl Clark said this is the most frustrating group of players he's managed in 10 years and I can see why. Cheltenham were a decent side and knew how to grind out a 3-0 result today. I don't think it was a 3-0 scoreline but at the end of the day we took another defeat. I've seen a lot of people on social media want Daryl Clark out the club but I still think he can build this squad up and get us promoted. On to Newport County on Tuesday. They're currently sitting top of the league so it's going to be a very tough game but hopefully we can bounce back with a win. If you enjoyed this video please leave it a like. Also subscribe to the channel if you're new. I'm trying to get to 1.1k subscribers by the 1st of December so if you could help me get there I'd really appreciate it. Also leave your thoughts on the game and up the saddlers. Please subscribe to Super Saddlers Sip.